Good morning. I give you praise, Lord God. I give you glory. I give you honor. I give you worship this morning. This is the day the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. Thank God for a new day. He found a way for me to praise him with my hands and I'm just thankful. Um, I just want to say a prayer today over your day. Um, the Lord gave me Second Chronicles the other day, 714. If my people who are called by my name shall humble themselves, pray, seek, crave, and require. This is the amplified version of necessity. My face and turn from their wicked ways. Then will I hear from heaven, forgive their sins, and heal the land. My people, God's people. Christians, the church, us, me, <laughs> uh, who are called by my name. Again, Christians, God's people who call on him daily, like I do. Humble, uh, meaning it, if we humble ourselves, not proud, not arrogant, come to him in humility. Even me, Lord. Hallelujah. Um, pray, talk to God. Listen to what he has to say back to us. Give him your petitions, your requests. Seek him, look to him, his word and fellowship. Seek is also in that scripture. Crave from the Amplified Version. Require of necessity. If you seek him, crave for him like you do chocolate or anything else you crave for. Any other addiction, crave him like that. Turn from your wicked ways course and redirection redirect yourself then will he hear from heaven and he will heal the land and it's just that simple you know we we go to him in prayer we listen out of obedience and hear that voice the voice is your own voice just like the devil when the devil speaks to us it's our own voice in our head but it's a distinction because some of the thoughts that you the thoughts that you, you that um when God speaks to us we know it didn't come from us it's just a, a clarity like that wasn't me that was the lord and when satan speaks to us it's usually fear it's attached to it like you feel fearful like oh god this is going to happen worry panic whatever but be encouraged today we're going to pray. Lord God, we thank you for a new day that we've never seen before. I'm in my car going to work. Give us traveling mercies, my family, me, to and fro our destination, whether by car, train, plane, bus, walking, in a car, parked. Give us traveling mercies to and fro our destination. I bind all accidents, hurt, harm, and danger, mechanical malfunctions in the name of Jesus over social media. The same, Father God, throughout their day, Lord God. Bless their coming and going. We're blessed going in and we're blessed going out. In the name of Jesus, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God. And it's just food for thought, that scripture for today. Uh, that you seek his face. Again, uh, from the other tape. <clears throat> Help is a prayer. Lord God, guide my day. Guide our day, Lord God. As your word says, you would, you would guide us with your eye, Father God. And we thank and we praise you. You said two could chase down 10,000, Lord God. And anyone under the sound of my voice, Lord God, bless their day. Let them think on whatever things are good, whatever things are lovely, whatever things of a good report, even me to think on those things. We're a work in progress. The Lord gave me something the other day. I have to find the scripture. It's when Peter um, actually denied Jesus and cursed Um the people out in regards to Jesus. Every time I read that scripture, it's funny to me. I have to find it. Find it. It's in the New Testament. But um, it's funny to me. And I'll elaborate more as the Lord leads me to get back on. But Peter was like, they was like, no, I think that's the guy that knows Jesus. And Peter was like, look, I don't know Jesus. And they asked him, no, wait a minute. That is him. And he, he cursed them out. He cursed them out. The Bible says he cursed them out. Like the four-letter word, he cursed them out. And the Lord just let me know that's our human frailty. At any moment, we could think on things that are not good. And the Lord said, do you think Peter's thoughts were good when he cussed them out? No. So the same with Peter is the same with us. We can, at, in a moment's time, think and want to cut somebody out. Do we do it? The Bible says we can be angry. Yeah, you can be angry. 
but sin not means you don't cuss nobody out. You know, sure, I felt like that a couple times, but um, when I give it to the Lord and redirect my conversation, humble myself, the Lord turns it around and I have something pleasant to say. But don't be discouraged when you feel that way. It's just that the Lord is letting you know that you're you're human. That's why we need him. We need a savior. So I hope your day is blessed. I hope this encouraged you, uh, this prayer. And let your day be sweet. Smile. Let your light so shine before men and women that they may see your good works as you glorify your Father in heaven. And don't give place to the devil. In Jesus' name, amen. Bye-bye. Have a great day. <laughs>